morning welcome back to the channel uh, I'm up in Fanabay at the Princess Inspire Hotel you have to have a look at this place it's something else okay I'm after walking down from the front yeah I'm after walking down from the front just to give you a little idea of what it's like now restaurant breakfast room is in here sorry Is that not the most impressive hotel you've seen? And again, for privacy, I'm gonna just kind of scan along here quickly. Swimming pool, absolutely spectacular. No shortage of beds. A lot of those double couple loungers, which are extremely comfy, but to me useless for getting the sun because they've got roofs on them. <laughs> and I do like my sun. This is seriously impressive another restaurant over there I mean just look at that it's like a cathedral now I'm assuming and please tell me down below in the comments uh, are there lifts in here because there's a hell of a lot of steps I'm sure there are lifts to get people up and down to those levels but this is absolutely stunning. You have a small pool on that side and another small one on this side. Beautiful little bar. Now, inside you have a spa. That you can book through reception. Well, I want us. This is the atrium. Pretty impressive. Okay, I'll show you exactly where it is in relation to the beach. So, the place is very quiet, very peaceful. And exceptionally clean. I actually reckon you could eat your dinner off the floor in that place. So we're up with your bearings. Fanaway shopping centre is over there. And this is the glorious entrance to the hotel. Princess Inspire. Wow. If you've stayed here, please comment down below. Let me know the rooms are like. Uh, it's just so chilled. It's so peaceful. I'm not sure whether it's adult only. Again, if you know, let me know. Comment. Leave a comment down below. <laughs> Sorry, comment down below always makes me laugh. I don't know why, but it does. So, <laughs> yeah, if you've stayed here before, let me know the rooms are like. Uh, so, let's see where we are in relation to the beach because this question was posed a while ago from there uh princess inspire how far was it down to the beach uh, i don't think it's that far it's a few minutes so i'll bring you with me and we'll have a little look so uh yeah and if, if, yeah, if you know whether you can get up and down those stairs with a lift let me know because it's an awful lot of stairs Now we also have another Hibiro star coming up here on the right hand side. I'm trying to sneak my way in there another day. But, uh, this is pretty impressive looking. Five star and looks every ounce of five star from the outside. I will cover it in another vlog. I'm hoping to get a lot of hotels done this trip and I'm only here for a short period. So plan is to get as many hotels done as possible. Give you a few ideas of the standard from 
no star to with the likes of that five star it's just a beautiful looking building even oh back in beautiful glorious Tenerife temperature at the moment is about 24 degrees and this is coming up to the end of May uh, nearly at the June bank holiday weekend so on 28th 29th of May Gourmet market. I don't know what the food is like, but cocktails for a fiver, six fifty. There's some beautiful hotels up this end. In fairness, let's see how far how far we get. One thing I love about Tenerife is, is this, it's just walking. There's, I mean, I reckon you can walk one out of the other, to be honest. I love getting up in the morning, heading out. This has been filmed at five to 11. And as I said, it's about, it's close to 24 degrees. Breeze is beautiful. That was a lovely, cool breeze blowing at the moment. So now, La Pinta, Port de Colón, is up that way. So you can see where you are now in relation to it. It's a great location. It's up that hill a little bit. It is not too bad. The hill is not that bad. Uh, but the uh, it's quiet. Now, in saying that, there's a couple of good bars up that end as well. Uh, so you, if you were sort of looking for somewhere for a late drink when you're on your way home after being down here, you could shoot into one of those. So this is it. We're down Fanai Bay Beach is on the right hand side over there. Down here, two good cocktail bars, Hugo's and Tanya's, both down here. Now I did find a cracking little spot last night which is around the corner from here. I might pass it on my next vlog. Uh, Wakanda, I uh, have to say one of the best pina coladas. Anyone who follows me on this knows I love pina coladas. It's outside of beer, it's probably the only thing I drink. Uh, but I do love a good pina colada. And to date, the best one I ever had was in uh, Mandaravara in Thailand. Just unreal, just unbelievable last night i think it's the closest i've ever got to it and it's to me it was probably the best uh pina colada ever had last night came very 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 close so hats off to the lads up there in wakanda uh, nice lad i was chatting to him afterwards and just nice young fella welcome india if you're looking for a good indian this is definitely it we've been in here a few times Really good value. Start is around five, six quid. Main course is around 13. Some of the curries there around 10. Food is amazing. Highly recommended. Staff are lovely as well. And this is Tanyos. Famous for its cocktails. As is, if you look straight across, you can see Hugo's in the distance there. Another fantastic bar. So there you go. This gives you a rough idea how long it's taken to get down. Probably about, I don't know, seven, eight minutes or so. And we're down towards the beach. Let's see if we can finish up on the beach. This will bring us down just at Porto Colón. So Fanabay Beach is to the right when we get down here. Mellow Gecko, another cracking little bar. So you've drank it there a few times. Solace. 10 out of 10. Food, beer, staff. Again, been there several times. Lovely vibe to it. Uh, real sort of Tenerife vibe, just chill out, 
if you're into your sports, great bar for sport. There's always TVs on with the sports on. Solace. And here you are, down at the beach. Well, this is Porta Cologne Beach, La Pinta Beach. And then Fanabay is literally two minutes around the corner. So there you go. Hope that helps somebody out. Beautiful hotel. I mean, sweet to mind. That is absolutely stunningly beautiful hotel. Okay, if you've been there, let me know because I'd love to know what the rooms are like. And I would also like to know whether or not you can get down that, down to that without, uh, if there's a lift, because there must be. Okay, hit the like, subscribe, bell for notifications, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Salon.